In today's video, you're gonna learn how to make quick money with photography. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you a refreshing and new way for you to make money with your photography. Now, you've probably all heard of stock photography websites and ways to sell your photos online, creating a calendar or doing prints. The truth is, unless you've got a large following on your website or social media, then you're only gonna make the odd bit of money here and there, but certainly nothing much. The way I'm gonna share with you today is one of the first ways I tried and I ended up making more money in one day of work than I'd ever earned in a day's work before. I didn't need to advertise, I didn't need a website, and I didn't need social media. Now I'm gonna tell you what this is in just one moment, but you've got to know that there is a right way to do this and definitely a wrong way. So it's important that you follow the steps in this video and ensure that you start making money and definitely don't waste your time. So about six years ago, I was sitting in a barber shop. I was waiting for the barber to come out and call me over to the chair. And I noticed on the window of this barber shop, there was this picture of some guy. And I just remember thinking how bad the quality of this photo was. I then thought if I think that the photo is bad, surely all the people walking past this business will have a similar impression of the photo as well. And that got me to thinking, this is why I'm probably sitting in an empty barber shop right now. So after I got my hair cut, I went home, I was really excited about this idea, and I started to think about it more and more. And I thought this is really a good idea. There is loads of local shops and businesses out there which definitely don't have photographers, and in a lot of cases, they have very average photos at best, which will not be advertising their business in the right way. Also, everything is so visual now. We spend most of our time looking at photos or videos on our phone, on our tablet, our laptop, our TV. So it's really important for these businesses to have a strong visual presence, both in store and online. And if they do this, they have a lot better chance of being successful. So how do you make quick cash with photography? Here's the steps you need to take. First, you've got to have some good quality images that you can put together in the form of something like a portfolio. Now this can be an actual physical copy, which I did to start with, or it could be online if you want. It could be on your social media or on your website if you have one of them. Now this is really important because it provides credibility to the business owner, showing them that you can take quality photos. The next step is to imagine yourself as the business owner. Basically, this means putting yourself in their shoes. The business owner probably loves his business. He works long, hard days trying to keep the business going and get enough money to provide for himself and his family. Because of this, you wanna be friendly with him and you definitely wanna give him some kind of genuine compliment about his business. You definitely don't want to go in there and say, hey, I noticed this really crap picture on the window, I can make it look better. So when you go in, introduce yourself and put yourself in their shoes. They probably don't have much time, they're probably very busy, so, you wanna keep things simple and you wanna probably open up with something like, hey, my name's Ben, I appreciate you're probably really busy taking care of your business right now. So I just wanna show you something for 30 seconds which I think you're really gonna like. And then you can open up your portfolio and you can say, I've been providing businesses in the local area with a professional photos and they've been using these to enhance their website, their social media, and in-store branding. And because of this, they're able to attract more customers and make more money. Is this something you'd be interested in for your business? Now the business owner is either gonna say yes, let me think about it, or he's gonna say no. But if he says yes, a reasonable price for you to charge would be anywhere between 150 to say 300 pound for 20 to 25 professional photos. This is gonna take you no more than 30 minutes to an hour, and then you can talk through if there's any specific photos he wants of his business, and you can add them in as well. Now, if he says, let me think about it, you've got to make sure that you get a business card or a phone number from them. 
and this means that you can contact them at a convenient time. Don't give them your details because chances are they're going to get caught up in something else and, well, you probably won't get that phone call. When you've taken the photos, you want to edit them, make them look as professional as possible. And a really nice touch to end it up with is to provide them with a bespoke USB stick. You can get these pretty much anywhere like an Amazon for like $10. People appreciate these little extras. Now you can visit loads of businesses doing this and earn some really good money. When you've done this job, you wanna ask the business owner politely if they'll be kind enough to let you display leaflets or business cards on their business address. This is a great way to attract more photography work from their customers. Also, you could ask them if they want to tag you on social media, and this gives you even more reach as well. Now, the chances are, if you've done a good job, the business owner will talk about these amazing new photos that you've taken for his business through word of mouth, creating more work for you. Now, if this way of making money with photography sounds a little intimidating, and let's say you're just a little bit more introverted, there's always another way to do it. You can go and do local Google searches for businesses in your area, contact them via email or phone and send them a digital copy of your portfolio. And just add a, a short message like we added earlier. Just introduce yourself, say that you understand the business owner is very busy and this is only gonna take 30 seconds of his time and then quickly get into how you've improved other businesses' web presence in the local area and their social media presence. And this is all being through your professional photo service. Then if they want your service, they can agree a day for you to go down and to take the photos. I hope you've enjoyed today's video, guys. I just hope it's something that's made you think outside the box and hopefully you can take action with this and start making money. Especially if, like me, you know that you love doing photography and it's what you want to do as your career. Any comments you have, please don't hesitate to leave them in the comment section of the video and I'll do my very best to answer each one of these later on. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And whatever you do for the rest of the day, guys, just make sure it's a good one and I'll see you in the next video.